Fuck up Bad League Mayhem 4. Everybody in this bitch, make some noise. Yeah. Yeah. All right, we got second battle of the night. Man on my left, introduce yourself. I'm right, 903 2214. King Leo. You know what I came to do? I came to view the body! Right, 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 right. All right. Visitor on my right. Richard Kirklinski. If you knew your history, my nickname would be no mystery. Battle Coliseum Island shit, man. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah! Yo! All right. So, three round battle, two minutes each. So, we agree on right? Cool. Leo chose to go first. No coin flip. All right, let's get it. <laughs> let's get one thing under motherfucking stood. I'm doing this for your own motherfucking good. I bust a nut in your pregnant wife just to let that vanilla ice, ice baby. But wait. But wait. That's yeah, yeah, too cold. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Too cold. Yeah, yeah. Let's start like this. What's good? How, you doing? How was your trip? My nigga. I bust a nut oh. in your <laughs> pregnant wife just to let that vanilla ice, ice baby. And what's crazy is after the battle, we'll still be cool because we both men. We know it's just words. Everything don't have to be battle rap. As soon as he give me that, I let it clap. The bullet pierce his ventricle and lodge in his cerebellum. Ain't that a bitch? Same one that break your heart be stuck on your mind forever. No, ain't that a bitch? How the one that break your heart, she be stuck in your mind forever? Let's go. Turn up. You gonna leave this war without a leg to stand on. Lieutenant Dan, I got a name that's impossible to trip on. Like Iceland, Greenland. See you like a granny with diabetes. You still be trying to cook, but now the food plan. So, <laughs> so how you want this to go? Act like you don't know. You want to be Kane versus Eileen, a cousin hanging out the six folk, or Raheem with all the juice and the snub nose? That's a body. That's a body. Dead in the bando. I catch you at home on your Xbox. You'll get a Halo playing Halo. You'll get to earn with this. Because I'm earning this shit. I do more than mark the room. With one fire round, I can make the whole earth move. Copernicus. They say, they say I'm perfect with the punch. A pugilist. They lied about how good of a man you was with the words. Eulogist. Stanley Kirk. <laughs> Stanley Kirk Burrell. MC with the ham, I'm too legit. Or better yet, Malcolm Luther X. By any means, you can die just chasing a beam, just chasing a dream. Barrel ain't dead in his mouth. He's digesting the beam. After this, it's back to losing. I'm going to send you back to the boot crying. Another no, you nigga. Losing his life just for truck. What? Not from Louisiana? No. So my source is lying? Nah, I know you not. You just die so much on cam, you should have to walk with a flat line. You should have to walk Fire. with a flat line. So either we gonna dance or I'm gonna punch you till I don't want to no more. Yeah, you'll get BBs from the king till the thrill is gone. <laughs> while I'm, till the thrill is gone while I'm clutching the chrome. So you might catch a couple pops with the punch like chaperones. They said, it's time. they said it's time for a nigga to die. And you looking like a dead nigga. Shoot first. We was aiming for, for the, the head, head, nigga. nigga. Round. All right, clap that shit up, y'all. Clap that shit up. Get my water. <laughs> Bottom of the first song, you like. I say how you want it. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Bars, jokes, schemes, wordplay, a lyrical content. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. No matter which route this big tub of lard take, yeah. he gonna have to deal with the consequences. I heard the dub was making some noise, but they ain't really messing with the Southern movement. Mm -hmm. I guess y'all got too many individual egos that don't know how to work together as a cohesive unit. But let y'all tell it, y'all holding it down for the better rap community. With y'all influence. Well, that's hard for me to believe when y'all support artists like this. 
That's stupid. Let me explain. <laughs> you had a nerve to wear a dashiki and drop the M bomb when you was rapping to a brother, but then want to be all respectful and get the man's space when you rapping against the opposite color. Talk but then it. again, it's not your fault. I blame that on your father and mother. Why you always yelling and screaming in your battles? It only proves that you need guidance and help, so that's why you joined the 130 tribe and decided to rename yourself Ooh. King Leo. Leader of the Thundercats is what you said when you battled nice. Knowing dang well that man name is Lion though, but you knew that wasn't right. See, we got another cheetah lying about how he drives a Jaguar with the pride of the Black Panther on his back. Talking about he got the eye of the type. Man, it's hard to believe in this wildcat. Let's go! Even, let's go. Even, even with me naming every single animal off that show, you still get viewed as a pussycat. Why y'all have a king versus an architect is what I can't seem to understand. You trying to kill and conquer everything that you see to prove why you should be the king of this land. I'm trying to build a structure to prove my dominance as a brand. While you getting war ready for battles to prove why you should be the next ruling man, I'm having conversations, making allegiances and alliances just from a shake of a hand. So how can y'all follow a king that doesn't have a kingdom to defend for what he stands, but the man that builds the kingdom, that draws the people, they tend to view him as the king of that land. But let's say your reign of terror did last. Right. Wouldn't last long enough for us to remember your banister. Yo. Living all high and mighty until you run into the likes of Jamie Lannister. I know why you added that king part to your name because you thought it would make it sound hard thinking if he writes at night on a round table and gets viewed on camera lot that we gonna see him as the king all the way oh, 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 i'm not biased fuck it. Even with that, even with that title, no, even with that title that still falls under steven king you barely even promote your battles within the ring so they're not going to view you as a Don King. You remind me of Larry King. You talk a good game in front of the camera, but I'm not believing that shit. So I got to treat you like Rodney King. In front of this camera, I got to kick your ass so you know who you fucking with. You always talking about you willing to swing the ratchet over the net. You remind me of Billie Jean King. It ain't a thing to put 40 to love, and I doubt you'll be able to match that if you're not careful about what you're saying because what I serve is known across the line, but it'll be your fault for not knowing the game we playing, the type of person. They get in the beef, oh, gotta call up his boys and get the rest of his clan. Me, I just get suited for that type of action, like a real proper gentleman. So in other words, when you see me looking like a Secret Service agent, just know I'm prepared to kill all the King's men. Mm. Brown. That was fire. That was fire. All right. I think that was fire. All right. Drop it a second. Hold down, hold down, hold down, hold down. All right. Protect your house. Could be food, bro. Protect your house. Drug dealing was a family pastime in East Texas. My bloodline crossed over to all the dope pictures, but they wouldn't let me off the bench. Had a different prophecy to fulfill as if my name was scripture, but the shit saved my life now. Because with the right amount of practice, hey, I could have been making plays off the snow like the old sixes. Yes, sir. <laughs> that's fire, man. Talk to him. Let's go. I could have been making plays off the snow like the old sixes. Faux gripper. Nah, that's that old shit. I need something to break the mold with, like break his molars, then beat him to the dentist to replace the filling plastic with plastic explosives. Yeah. The crime organized. La Costa Nostra, but you should know all of them. You should know all about that. Richard Kirklinski? Yeah, I did my history, and the only mystery is why you name yourself after such a stupid person. <laughs> I'm just going to call you man, because ice? Now, you're really not that cold in person, but I'll let the bulldog ice man for certain. You know, let the faux faux finger roll under his brim, because the only ice man I respect is George Gervin. Yeah. Then send the smurder over the phone. Just hit the hot boy on the hotline. That's all it takes. Wait. Hot boy? Hotline? That's Bobby Drake. I'm still ice. Wow. That was fire, bro. Fire, nigga. Head on you, bro. Fire, nigga. Bobby Drake Ice Man, nigga. Fire. Bobby Drake, I'm still Iceman. And if I ice man with the steel, his body freeze instantly. They don't know what time he died. Damn. Now I'm Richard Kirklinski. See, I'm clearly gonna I'm clearly gonna have to set it off 
so y'all can oh. see Lee. They don't know what time he died. They don't know what time he died. Damn. Now I'm Richard Kerklinski. I'm going to clearly have to set it off so y'all can see Leo Cleo Tuffer. See? Leo Cleo Tuffer. Get shot for the mistake set in your head like Stoney, brother. What's the, what's the procedure when a gun is in your face? I had this nigga who looked uh, 50 in the face looking a 50 in the face. I had this nigga who looked 50 in the face looking a 50 in the face. If he survived this shit, I've been patiently waiting to make a nigga look 50 in the face. To make a nigga look 50 in the face. If he loses train of thought, the bullets make a tunnel for his dreams to go. 38 snub on vacation. Through his window, I poke a nose. Congo flow. This Congo soul. This flow is harder than the ice cubes in trap house water. If you understand, that's what makes it dope. Different levels to this shit. That's what they look at. Keep going. Keep going. This flow is harder than the ice cubes in trap house water. If you understand, that's what makes it dope. Different levels to this shit. It's what they look at the boy and see. That's how I stay the flow. Ravishing Rick Rude hips. <laughs> they said it's time for a nigga to die. You looking like a dead nigga. Shoot first. Because we was aiming for the head, head nigga. Yeah. Round two. All right, y'all. All right. All right. All right. All right. Ice is back. I say, yo, 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 hold on. I said, with this K, I. NG, so after you take this L, I O D F W, a brand new bar that's played by the rap community. Nick got you walking with your head up to the cloud saying he gonna make you a star. Not knowing I was trained to give people a shot at their highest opportunity. They say it takes a village to raise a man. Usually. I'm at your funeral being mad disrespectful because I'm giving a speech. At the eulogy, like, y'all actually care about this fat motherfucker, bro. <laughs> the way your family stood up for you in perfect unity was nice. But it also was a cold turn to find out who I should give a shout out to next so I can teach a lesson to the rest of your people not to raise this type of bullshit in their community. Your mom must love you a lot. But she don't really care too much about your help. I always talk about you came to view the body. Because you can't stand to view yourself. Let's go. Let's go. Get that motherfucker! Right. Right. <laughs> you remind me of Mufasa. That's me, Aragorn. Ned Stark. Leonidas. That's the vibe I feel. Because I know you plan to act of a king because this king can't be real. Because if this king was real, where are your loyal subjects? Who have you killed, enslaved, and what land have you conquested? Oh, I get it. You thinking if you eat like a king, I'm supposed to treat you like a king. I think you taking the words out of context. In fact, that's why you joined the 130 tribe to get under the wing of a real king and learn the proper etiquette of how to act. You are the darkest gummy bear I have ever seen in my life. <laughs> Go! What else? I told my amigo I was doing this one for the culture. Just to enthuse me, DFW offered me a t-shirt and I called Casting Bank like, nah, I'm doing this one off the muscle. Truly. Besides, I need to speak to the king and take a look at his queen to see if she was really bad and bougie, so I'm going to get right with you. I'm going to have you slippery as can be the minute I put this big on big. So what's the price for that brown bag special? I'm being dead serious. You dig? I mean, she's all ass with the face of Kelly Price, and I appreciate her going out her way to speak to each and every single That's one of fine. my kids. Yeah. Now, some of y'all probably going to hate on this. 
probably gonna say some of them bars ain't mean. But what I'm basically saying is your girl's a hoe and loves taking shots to the face for the team. I heard you like getting disrespectful in your back. Yeah. But yet you can't back it up with none of the action. Always dancing around that type of friction, trying to cut a rug, knowing it's bound to be some static. So stop gambling mm -hmm. with your life and mm -hmm. doing all these antics before I pull your card. You ain't nothing but a big flop. I knew you was going to turn from the minute you seen the river from high your panic. I called you a bluff for what you was trying to bet, thinking he should ante up, knowing he should have folded. But then again, he never was thinking straight to realize that this Texas hold him. I can tell from the deal, I can tell from the deal, you wasn't used to seeing those type of numbers like bingo. And y'all got the nerve to say he deserves to be at the high stakes table with me or something. I could see no. Oh. Watch how, oh. it's Watch how I check mate with a simple IQ test. Yeah. Everybody knows about how this young bull makes his move. Call it the Bobby Fisher effect. I'm only threatening your queen because I know it affects the king. I thought you said that you played chess. Because I study and analyze the tactics so I know how to peak threats and yet you still want to play the game with me knowing it's going to lead to a slow death. So stop focusing on the material things in front of you and you'll realize how I was able to get you. Because in order to peep the setup, you got to take a step back and see the bigger picture. By the time that dawns on you, it's going to be too late like a broken watch. Because no matter which way you look at that scenario, you're always going to end up doing the king in a box. Because, you know, when you play chess, you end up seeing True. the king in the box. Gosh, and the whole yeah. point to put him in check is to put the king in, in the, the box. box. But look, when Ben load this up on YouTube, you're going to end up seeing the king, king in, in the, the box. box. <laughs> Round. All right, All right, man. Clap right. it up, clap it up, clap it up, man. We got a battle. Leo, fight back. back on you, bro. Fight back. So it's the third round, right? Cool. <laughs> well, nigga, give it up. <laughs> the jig is up. Bow. Face shot. His wig is up. I'll put a bounty on your head, then gamble with your life. You trying to bid or what? Oh, yeah? You'd rather throw your life away trying to catch the fame? One swing to crumble your face. Immediately after, he clawed and Ray at the Yankees game on life. He can't remember why the fuck we was fighting in the first place. He can't remember. He can't remember why the fuck we was fighting in the first place. But I seen him after the battle. On his face, like on his mind, was some gruesome. From across the parking lot, all I heard was "fuck that." How you wanna go? Lyrical content. <laughs> All I heard was some rah rah. Nah, fuck that. You know how it goes. It's lyrical content. And I'm gonna shoot it. So I looked in the trunk like, should I grab the two texts or the Uzi? I quickly picked up both texts like, fuck it, coach. We already losing. <laughs> 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 Trunk like, should I grab both texts of the who's? Uh -huh. I quickly picked up both texts like, fuck it, coach, we already lose. Yes. I don't even give a fuck about winning no more. I know, tragic. But you need this shot to pay off more than Jesus Shuttleworth, Dad. And I don't care if I got lines that get quoted. The pen is still so paranormal, they actively think that a ghost wrote it. Nigga. The pen's still so paranormal, they actively think that a ghost wrote it. The gun smoking, nickel, his cage in flames like the ghost rider just wrote in. Or, or if I hit him with this, Nicky won't respond for months like Remy wrote it. The gun smoking, nickel, his cage in flames like the ghost rider just wrote in. Or if I hit him with this, Nicky won't respond for months. Like Remy wrote it, try to retaliate and see no switch in the power hand. Ricky Tan meets Peter Pan. Try rushing hours and fuck around and never, never land. Oh my God. Fuck around and never, never land. Don't look. Don't look. Don't try to downplay my style. You know it's a Tommy. You won't live long enough to see another round this fight. Haley's coming. Mm, that was fire. 
You won't live long enough to see another round this fire. Haley's coming. And if this the beginning to the DFW versus BC war, I already know who I want next from your roster. The imposter that be supplying the pasta. The nigga you know. I know he's talking about James The imposter that be supplying the pasta. You know, with the shrimp, the gumbo, sausage, and the lobster. Because I figure if y'all gonna give me a plate, I might as well eat with the nigga in the kitchen like a racist mobster. <laughs> I might as well eat with the nigga in the kitchen like the racist mobsters. Or give me Christ from. Because at least I know he'll give me three rounds if he know he can reach in his pocket and check his iPhone. The light was too bright at the top and it distracted him. I addressed his priorities with a big nose. X Factor. Sir say, yeah. 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 Sir say it's like basketball. I say fuck, sir. <coughs> this the gridiron player. Ten toes down with the arm out. Like the back of the end zone fader. Now this next, oh, fuck. That was, that was now this next part, I'm going to have to break it down because it's so great. Y'all might not even catch it on camera later. But if I moss you without the pistol, I'm putting Brian Dawkins on cornerback and you getting Sean Taylor. You the only one who got what I said. I think you're the only one who got what I said. But, but <laughs> I think you're the only one who got what I said. But if I catch you without the gun, I'm taking the eagle off safety and you'll lose life from a shot to the leg. He said it's time for a nigga to die. And you looking like a dead nigga. Shot first, you own be some, right? It's you the head, nigga. Close it out, Ice. Close it out. I say. One in a million people can deal with my scheming, even when you're at your best. So I don't want to hear how he's hot like fire can deal with me as a scheming threat. Are you that somebody that other league viewers have met? I doubt it. I'm not going to go back and forth with somebody that's down with a click and still wilding for respect. I've been writing four-page letters full of schemes until my mind gets stuck. The thing I like about Leo is that he embraces that big boy side of him. So y'all got to give it up. The only person I seen go on a diet plan fail. I told him to try again. He said, nah, he only did it to find out if he was big enough. We need to find a resolution to you trying to devour everything up like a beast. I mean, you're already in the shape of two people, and we trying to make sure you come back in one piece. I told your girl I'm willing to rock the boat to make her more than a woman, but she says she misses you, which is a bum. So you really want to be with him? I guess. Whatever. So I figure I'll leave your chick laying by you so y'all can die together. Now that scheme was, uh, but I think I want to that scheme was, uh, but I think I can do a little bit better. So I'm going to redo the whole entire thing and jump back 10 years from a different time there. Like, my hustle and grind is how I'm able to rock bands, bro. A private eye told me you was wasting your money on a rich girl. Say it isn't so. I can't go for that. Saying that she's gone and out of touch and it's been like that for a while. But then again, one-on-one, Leo told me he knew she was a man-eater and does whatever it takes to make Sarah smile. So you mean to tell me Talk you got your girl out shit. here putting her body at risk just to make your dreams come true by using her throat? But then again, it made sense why every time I seen her, her mouth was always full of all and notes. Now, that scheme was, uh, but I think I can do a little bit better. So I'm going to redo the whole entire thing and jump back another 10 years from a different time there. Like, one of these days, those lying eyes going to tell the truth about how you got so round. So take it easy before you find out why they brought the new kid in town. That tequila sunrise got you thinking as an outlaw mind. You're not really using your cerebral. Out there stunting, living the fast life line like you evil Knievel. It's going to make me have to call my people to go and, what's it going to make me have to call my goons to go and snatch up your people and have them laid out in the Hotel California all because they were dying to meet the Eagles. You knew you was dead the minute this battle was booked. It's up to you and did not nah, scratch that. Remember that? Thing that you made a comment on a thing on Facebook thing, I could do a certain scheme about a certain thing. Well, watch how I do this. See, I used to be a fan mm -hmm. of pink, but hanging out with the reds and blues, I learned that black was the reason why yellow. I was always seeing a yellow tape. In order for us to be great, you gotta learn how to extend the hand. Hey, hey Leo, that's how you do a scheme about the pirate. Oh, I'm so fucking up.
Yeah, I can't yeah, bring it back. I, I, say, bring it back. I said, yeah, I used to be a fan yeah. of pink. Yeah. By hanging out with your reds and blues, I learned that black was the reason why I was always seeing the yellow tape. In order for us to be great, you got to learn how to extend the hand and work with a stranger. Yo, Leo, that's how you do a scheme about the Power Rangers. You lucky this wasn't for no green. Uh -huh. But with that time, you would have found out why they don't want me working with that machine. But for that white, mm -hmm. I would have had that dagger talking to you. The captain take your head and mm -hmm. mount it on the wall and have your teammates talking to you. But what you going to say? That whole thing was set up. Oh, right now wasn't call. that live until I had a machine talking to your teammates, but it won't be out for five. You thinking you mm -hmm. safe? Let's well, go. Out to Hollywood. Wooden. Got you a couple of figures, but hey, even in the new Power Ranger movie, they still killed off the niggas. Yeah! Wow, man. Yeah. 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 Yeah.